Yeah. Are you connected to the Wi-Fi in here? I just thought to pick it up. I'll call the meeting to order for the Lycomico County Council uh, Legislative Session 2018-25 for December 27, 2018. Those that like to stand and join us in the Lord Prayer and Pledge of Allegiance, please do. Early. Good morning, Mr. President, council members, ladies and gentlemen. Um, today, this morning, we have resolution number 146, 2018, to authorize the county executive to accept a donation of property from Connolly Mill Associates, LLP, consisting of 234.67 acres, more or less, located on the southerly side of Connolly Mill Road, adjacent to the Henry S. Parker Athletic Complex. Um, this resolution was on the last council agenda and it was tabled to today. Um, there have been some discussion as far as a few proposed amendments, um, one of which is to add a number five to exhibit B, which is the list of specifications for the insurance. Um, <clears throat> Our legal counsel actually has recommended to add number five that would say policy form PARL6 CP and then three or four ones um, endorsed as indicated in the Wacomico County Pollution Assurance Overview um, titled draft revision number 13, 2018, including deletion of the form provisions regarding jurisdiction and venue in choice of law. Entertain a motion to bring resolution 146, 2018 back. Table. table. Second. 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 All those in favor? Aye. 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 Okay. Is there any discussion on that proposed amendment? <clears throat> Let me do an entertainment a motion to approve resolution 146 2018. If I could. Entertain a motion to um so moved. Second. Second. All right. Discussion. Um, I'd move to accept that amendment as read. Okay. Uh, there's a motion uh, to amend uh, Resolution 146, 2018, as noted by Mrs. Hurley. Uh, motion was made by uh, Councilman Kilmer. Is there a second? Second. Discussion on the amendment? Seeing none. All those in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Motion's carried. Amendment's been approved. Mrs. Hurley? Um, legal counsel has also recommended that item number three in the resolution be deleted in its entirety. Um, and to add a new whereas paragraph that would state, whereas the Maryland Department of Environment has issued surface mining exemption number 18-WI-0003, which states the county, states that the county is authorized to operate a borrow pit on part of the property from December the 21st, 2018 until December 31st, 2023, solely in connection with the construction, repair, and maintenance of public facilities subject to certain conditions stated in that document and in accordance with certain plans specified therein. And I hear a, a motion for the amendment as proposed. So moved. Second. second. We have a motion and a second. Any discussion on the amendment? I have one question. I'm sure. hold this whole procedure. When do you um, plan to start digging? West yeah, Weston, you might as well come on up right now. We know that there's a time limit for the start. There's probably no guarantee that the, that the permit or exemption will be uh, continued after 23, but when do you start? Sure. So, so real quick, the 23 deadline is um, erosion and sediment control. Right. Just like construction plans, you need to update those periodically. Um, sometimes regulations change. But um, we plan to mobilize on the site fairly rapidly upon acceptance to secure it. We, we spoke about security. Um, we 
I guess in the um, memo I provided several meetings ago, we looked at if we did everything in-house. Um, I think we'll also look at can we get, um, say, private dump trucks, and does that look affordable? Um, does that make sense for us? Because then that we could get started sooner than having to procure uh, five trucks. If we go the, the dump truck route, we'd probably put it in the budget. So I would, I would expect um, summer, late summer, 2019, if we did it in-house, if we can use somebody else's trucks, then um, we could go a lot faster. I guess my concern that there was no activity being done on the site, you know, between now and 22 or 23, that sure. there would be some, some reluctance to renew the, renew the exemption. Yeah, no, I hear you. Yeah. No. Thank you. Yes, sir. Um, I was going to ask the same question on the um, sediment control and in 2023. Um, how long does the mining permit last? Um, the mining permit has an ex well, I guess it also has an expiration of 2023, um, the, the exemption. So we have a permit now and that we renew every five years for the one that we have next to the landfill. Um, that's also a good time that if we were making any changes, such as expanding the footprint, um, you know, it says the exemption area should not exceed 55.75 acres. Um, we're talking 37 acres of ponds, and then the rest of the 55 acres is, um, you know, where the trucks would be driving and the excavator would be going in and out. Um, so every five years, it's a good time to uh, update the plan, show what we've completed, as well as uh, if, if there were any proposed modifications. Um, what we did with our, our current borrow pit at one point was we pumped, pumped the water down so that we could dig deeper. We're not proposing doing that with this, but we could at that five-year mark. So again, this was, this was an exemption. Um, MDE, even the county at this point, has a lot of people off this time of year. So we didn't get it as fast as uh, we wanted, but um, yeah, I, I don't see them <coughs> denying this in, in the future. Any other questions? Seeing that all those in favor of the amendment say aye. 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 Opposed? Motion's carried. Second Amendment passes to Resolution 146, uh, 2018. The other amendment for Council's consideration <coughs> is the um, property taxes for 2018-2019 in the amount of $9,571.45. If council is interested um, in reimbursing Conley Mill Associates LLP for those prorated taxes, two amendments would need to be made. One would be to um, the fourth whereas paragraph in the resolution, and then as well as the agreement that's attached as Exhibit A, it would be on page two, number four, that dollar amount would increase to $44,571.45. So then I would um, <clears throat> ask for an amendment, a motion for an amendment to both sections Correct. with one amendment. So moved. We have a motion and second. 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 Motion, second, discussion. Yeah. I've um, expressed my hesitation with this in the past. Um, I have a talk with Mr. Smithhurst. <clears throat> This is, uh, appears to be the price to get the deal done. So while I'm not thrilled with it, um, you know, paying this money to get this amount of dirt is a fair trade off. And so I'll reluctantly support this, but I'm not thrilled about it. So. Any discussion? Seeing none, all those in favor of the amendment say aye. 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 Opposed? Nay. We have one nay, chair votes nay. Um, uh, the amendment uh, for resolution number 146, 2018, in reference to the additional 9000 Um, It's $9,571.45. Passes. Okay. Um, that being said, any further discussion on resolution 146, 2018, as amended? Seeing none, all those in favor of resolution 146, 2018, as amended, say aye. 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 Opposed? Nay. Motions carry. Resolution passes. Thank you, Wes. Thank you for your time. <coughs> Thank you, Wes. Yes, sir. Can I just express my thanks and appreciation to the members of the council for this has been, you know, long going on. But I think when you all and the rest of the county residents look back in five or ten years, that this will have been one of the best 
things that the council has done. Uh, it's what my my clients wanted done. They wanted to see the county get it. And I think even after you take all the dirt out that you need for your uh, landfill, you're still left with all the property. And right. even the part where you've excavated the dirt can be some sort of a water recreate oriented recreational area. And you've got the rest of the 175 acres to use however you want to use. So. Right. Well, we, we appreciate uh, you and your organization giving that, get, making that offer to the county. Uh, it's taken a long time, but it's only because you know we're we're responsible to, for our due diligence to the taxpayers. And I think we we you would agree with us when I said we more than vetted that <laughs> properly. So, uh, but I, I agree with you. And I think most of the council does too. I'm very anxious to see how this moves forward, and, and I'm really anxious to see the benefits we're going to get, as you said, not only with the landfill, but hopefully future, in the future with uh, record oh, parks. Yeah. It's not like when you dig the dirt, you're, you're, not, you're still going to have the 235 acres. Right. All right. Thank you, Mr. Mathers. We appreciate it. Thank you. At this time, we open the floor for public comments. If there are any comments, come to the podium. Please state your name, your county of residence, and your concerns. That concludes public comments. Uh, council comments. I have a quick comment to make. Uh, we lost over the holidays, Christmas time of... Uh, very, very major uh, player in our community in terms of uh, activism and uh, involvement with Mike Prettle. Uh, you know, I think all of us up here know Mike. And uh, one of the traits that I know personally I admired in Mike was was courage. You know, Mike always had the courage to stand up for what he believed in, and uh, you know that's a that's a trait that. Uh, personally, I admire in anyone, but I think, you know, all of us admire that, and he's going to be sorely missed, and, you know, I think uh, everyone certainly sends out their uh, prayers and thoughts to M his wife, Michelle, and their family. Thank you, Councilman McCain. Any other council comments? Under presidential comments, I would uh, just simply, um, you know, uh, reiterate what Councilman McCain said. Uh, Michael was a, he was a good guy. He was a, he was very, uh, <coughs> Uh, he, he defined his positions and, and let you know exactly what his positions were. But he was very tactful in that. The last time I met him, it was, it was maybe only two weeks ago at a particular event. And the first thing he wanted to do was to discuss solar power and let, you know, want to know when that might be coming up on the agenda again. So uh, Mike was always there at the forefront and, uh, and uh, certainly will be missed. Uh, we, his sympathies do go out to, our sympathies do go out to his family. Um, I also like to recognize Laura Mitchell, who uh, is now in the room. Laura, good to see you Hi, very much. You. Are you coming back to the city council for us? <laughs> <laughs> okay, good to see you. I entertain a motion from council to adjourn. So, so, all those in favor? Aye. Opposed? Please adjourn.